So these are all the different lunch balls that they have. So you've got the turkey and cheddar ones, you've got the pepperoni and mozzarella ones, you've got chicken dunks, which we can never get back in the UK. They've also got breakfast ones as well. This is the breakfast sausage and cheese one, which looks amazing. And then they also do these ones, which is nachos, cheese dip, and salsa, which is probably gonna be one of my favorites, I'm not gonna lie. And you've also got ham and American here, which looks like you've got Oreos in the packet. These are more ham and American ones. You've got cheesy pizza down here. You've got pepperoni pizza. Like, why don't we have all these options back in the UK? I definitely need to get one of these for my breakfast and I definitely also want to pick up one of the chicken ones as well. I also want to get the nacho cheese and salsa because I'm a little bit obsessed with nachos and I also want to get the pizza one as well so I'm going to grab the extra cheesy pizza. I also really want to get this one because that pizza looks very interesting and I'm also going to get the classic ham and American just ham. Oh you don't even get, wait do you get cheese in that? I don't know. We'll get it anyway. That's for my lunchables. So I had to buy a few other things as well, but all of the Lunchables come to $13, but for a day and a half's worth of food, I really don't think that's that bad. Perfect. I can't wait to eat Lunchables for 24 hours. Today is the day that I am doing my 24 hours eating Lunchables. So I literally have a drawer of Lunchables in this fridge. And this morning we are actually off to do the Hollywood hike. So I think I'm gonna have this one tomorrow morning. I'm gonna save that. So for my lunch, I don't really know which one to take. Do I fancy the pizza? I don't even know if I have to cook this or how like you even go about it. I think I'm gonna take the extra cheesy pizza one up on the hike with me. And then I'm also gonna take, can I take this one? Should I just take the classic one with me? Yeah, I'll take the classic one with me just in case. I changed my mind i just saw that i had the nacho cheese dip and salsa and i feel like on top of the mountain i'm really gonna want that so i take that back i'm actually gonna take this one with me and then i'm gonna take the pizza one with me too we are midway through the hollywood hike i say we're maybe like halfway there three quarters at a push and in a second i'm gonna stop and have my first lunchable because i do not do a lot of exercise this is really really challenging and i'm absolutely starving so i think i'm gonna have the pizza one because i'm really really craving it in the meantime this is gonna be my view for today's lunch the hollywood sign is up there that's what we're eventually hiking to but what you can see down there is downtown LA we are now a bit further up and I'm just gonna wait till the top to have my lunchable because you know we're smashing this walk we're now this far up and the end destination is just there and we made it I mean does lunch look any better with the Hollywood sign behind it so inside this one there is I think there's four mini pizzas or there's three mini pizzas and then you get cheese and then you get salsa so now I'm gonna sit and make the pizzas okay so I'm gonna put some of the salsa on I didn't bring any spoons to spread it with so this is gonna be fun and then sprinkle some cheese on top god these lunch balls are so much better than the ones back in the UK I wish we sold these we are currently sat in the shade and I'm gonna do a taste test of my pizza for them to eat in there as well <laughs> Oh my god, that's unreal. Is it nice? That is so good. Have you tried it yet? Mm -hmm. That is so good. Lunch has never looked better. Like, I would happily eat this every day for the rest of my life with the Hollywood sign in view. I finished that pizza in literally five seconds and I rate it a solid 10 out of 10. I'm actually going to take some of them home if I can. They are that good. The next one I'm going to go for is this one, and this is the Lunchable Nacho Cheese and Dip Salsa. The next one I'm going to eat is the Nacho Cheese Dip and Salsa, and this is the one I've been most excited for because this whole trip we have literally been binging off of like salsa tostitos, I think it is. I don't know how you say it. Oh my god, this one's amazing. <gasps> Oh my god, that looks so, so good. I'm just gonna have to leave it like that because I can't rip that off, but taste test. Oh my god, it's unbelievable. Unbelievable. That is exactly what I needed after this hike. I don't do exercise. All we eat on this channel is McDonald's, so this is a change. This is literally the best thing to ever happen to us this whole way up. Mm. This is making me so excited now to try all the other Lunchables because I was a bit like, mm, I don't know if I'm going to like them when I bought them. But I've got like a chicken nugget one at home. Mm. Yeah, I've got a chocolate pizza one at home. I've got, I don't remember, there was like a ham and cheese one. Oh, I've got a breakfast one. I've got like a breakfast McMuffin one, which looks really good as well. This one is I'm definitely really like one up there. This was like $2 as well. And look how many you get. We are now well rested and we are going to head back down. So I'm going to pop the rest of this in the bin. How's the fray? I want to get salads or like acai bowls or like smoothies or something. Drinks don't don't count so I guess I could get a smoothie but for food obviously I'm gonna have to have another lunch ball. but for now bye Hollywood sign honestly this has been on my bucket list to do for years and I'm so so happy that we finally done it and obviously to film the lunch ball video in front of it as well that's pretty sick 
we are back and we are going to head straight back out so i need to pick up another lunchable so i don't really know which one to go for i think this time i'm going to go for the chicken chunks one that actually looks so good it is a little bit late now we have been shopping on melrose for a while and everybody else has actually come to earth cafe and i was like oh yeah i really fancy the mac and cheese and then i realized i actually can't so instead i'm going to be having my chicken dunks lunchable they smell like refrigerators oh i like refrigerators it scares me though that the fact that they're in the fridge, like, do you know what I mean? Yeah, I know, it's weird, isn't it? And Oreos, that's such a weird mix. No. I just thought that was going to taste so much nicer. It just tastes like cold chicken nugget to me. I mean, it's not bad, bad. I think it tastes quite nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'd eat that. I've also got Oreos as well. These are the double stuff ones, so. They're good. Dinner's looking um pretty small tonight, I'm not gonna lie. We've got three chicken nuggets, two Oreos, and some ketchup, but that's fine. I've got more lunchable stuffed in the fridge when I get home. Good morning everyone. So I am about to have my breakfast and this morning I've got the Lunchable Brunchables breakfast sausage and cheese one. I'm currently just outside our Airbnb because today we're actually going to the Warner Brothers studio tour, which means obviously I'm gonna take another Lunchable with me. But for now, I'm gonna have this one for my breakfast. I fully feel like Billy Ray Cyrus this morning. Like I've got a checkered shirt and I've got a hat on. I really do. Um, oh my God, this looks interesting. Okay, so this sausage, I just feel like you're meant to cook these, but it just says keep, like you're not, Oh, I don't know. This is what it looks like inside. So I've got two little like breakfast sandwich things. I think these break in half so I can make two. Yeah, okay, I've got two of these. This is the sausage. This is what's making me a little bit nervous. And then this is the cheese. Back home, I love a good like McDonald's sausage and egg McMuffin. They're like my favorite things ever. But this is just making me a little bit nervous. Oh no, it really doesn't smell good either. This is definitely like my least favourite one out of all of them so far just because I feel like you're just meant to cook them but obviously you're not because they're Lunchables but eating cold sausage just doesn't like sit well with me. It's okay, I mean like if I needed like a breakfast in a rush then I definitely would go for this and it's fine for my breakfast this morning because I am in a little bit of a rush, we're meant to be leaving in 15 minutes. It also comes with a little muffin, that's what I love about these Lunchables, they all come with like a little extra. So yesterday obviously some come with Oreos, this is a blueberry muffin though and I don't normally like blueberries so let's give it a try. That's that's the best thing in here. That is so fresh and there's like one blueberry in this muffin as well which is like perfect because I literally don't like them, it's just one there. Overall, I'm gonna rate this maybe like a four out of 10. The muffin was a 10 out of 10 but the rest of it I'm not that keen on. I don't know if there's any other breakfast ones that they do. I feel like this was just the only one. I mean, not my favorite thing in the world. Yeah, not really my favorite thing but the muffin was really good. I'm excited for my lunch one. The one I'm going to have to bring with me today is going to be this one, which is the classic ham and American. And you get Oreos with it again, which I'm very happy about. So for my lunch today, I'm actually not eating in like a normal cafe. I'm actually in the Central Perk Cafe on the Friends set at Warner Brothers. And it's a Universal at Warner Brothers. And I bought my lunch with me, of course. So we're going to eat some lunch. House is over here with her Central Perk cupcake. And I've got my classic Lunchable. I've got the ham and American one today. Here's my Lunchable. You don't get as many crackers as you do in the UK ones. You literally only get six whereas in the uk ones that's why you get 12 but okay starving so let's give it a taste test oh i like the american cheese the american cheese is really really good and again in this one you also get two are these double stuffed i don't know if it's double stuffed or just normal but oreos Freya is also uh, tucking into the lunchable lunchable you know we're just providing the lunch nowadays and I very much enjoyed my lunch in Central Perk Cafe. I mean, at least it wasn't something from the cafe, but the lunchable was still pretty good. We are now home. It is actually a lot later. It is nearly 11 o'clock and I'm going to have my final lunchable. Even though it has been way over 24 hours, but then tomorrow I can just start completely afresh and have cereal for breakfast. So we just got back from Kira's actually. That was really nice seeing her, but I was going to take my lunchable and then I just completely forgot. So I'm just going to have it now. And the final one in the drawer is going to be my pizza one, my chocolate pizza, and then my Capri. Sun. Here it is. I'm not gonna lie. I'm very excited that this is gonna be my last lunchable because the portion sizes are just very very small And whilst I'm in LA, I actually want to enjoy having all the food that LA has to offer So I'm kind of glad that this is nearly over These are different to the ones we have in the UK and then so you get one chocolate sachet And then you get one sachet full of salsa and then you get cheese and then you get like little like smarter type things Just like the one yesterday you get three different pizza bases and then this I'm guessing has got the chocolate in I'm just gonna use the packaging to spread it because this is gonna go in the bin. So sorry, this is gonna annoy so many people. 
I've got my chocolate and then I'm just gonna sprinkle. I don't know if these are smart teas yet. I'm actually not sure exactly what these are. Mmm, that's really good. I feel like it's best to have it when it's like freezing cold so the chocolate and the chocolate chips are like really nice and like icy, if you know what I mean. Back in the UK, lunch was literally so basic. Like you just have like the ham and the cheese or like I think you can get like turkey maybe. Like literally there's two to choose from that you never get like a drink included, so. Oh, that's so good. The tropical tide one. Oh my god, this is amazing. Normally I just go for like raspberry or strawberry. But this is where I'm gonna end my video. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you guys have enjoyed watching me eat lunchables for the last 24 hours. If you did, please smash a huge thumbs up. And other than that, I will see you very, very soon for a brand new video. Mwah. Bye.